Alright, so let's go to the 3DS Max 8. This might take a minute. Alright, we're gonna minimize and maximize the viewport at the bottom right over here. Then we're gonna create a plane of 10 by 10. Like this. We right click on it and we choose convert to editable mesh. Then we get another option over here, editable mesh at the top right. We click on vertex. And then you'll see, if you press on F3, you'll see it clear, much more clear. You see all these blue dots, these are vertices. And we're going to select a few. Which we want to alpha blend on. So, where a second texture is applied on top of it. Then we go to the colors over here. At the bottom right, we click on it and we set it to black. Then we go to the display tab at the bottom top right and we tick vertex colors and we click the button shaded. Then if you press F3 again, you'll see it turns black. That's the spot where another texture will appear on top of the main texture. Alright, so if we texture this now, we press the M button, then we get this, we name it, for example, ground, and then we click on the standard button, we select W3D, and we do OK, and we're going to set the material type to something we want, like rock. And we change the passes to 2. On the pass 2 tab, we're gonna change ambient and diffuse to white. Like this. The shader tab is alpha blend. And then the texture, the main ground texture, so the rock. Go to the materials folder. Hold on a sec. Then we pick a nice ground texture, ground rock on one. Right, then we hit display. And we go to pass one. We leave this as it is on the vertex material. The shader is set up correctly, and then we go to the textures tab. We enable the stage zero texture. And this will be the snow texture that will be blended on top of the ground texture. So, ground snow 01 will do. We're going to open it. And then we assign it to the material with this button over here. That's basically it. Then maybe you want to set the W3D options on it. With the tools option over here at the top right. We're going to set it to V Alpha, Physical Projectile and Camera. And then when we export this as a W3D. Then if we load it up in the editor, mm, where is it? Over here. Then I got it under the train over here. If we make this, it should work. And it should blend the textures. Which it does. 
like so. Then you gotta blend the texture. So good luck with that. <laughs> 